Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. I'm the series strategy game, and we are returning to a loot and pillage run. Playing the Spanish against the Aztecs in humankind. So, uh, let's see what's going to uh, gonna get on. Uh, we have the Etruscans down here, which are currently in decline. They are the delivery point for us for at least two resources, so probably we should uh, try to integrate them uh, before they are all gone. But, um, yeah, let's see. We are going to have the turn here. Just last time around, we did build another Civic, so that is going to be uh, an important thing there. Um, and I'm guessing we can get... Ooh. One of the Builder Stars. Um, so, violence has put to us selling stuff. That's okay, we don't need to be selling stuff too, too badly. Um, that being said, I do want to buy some more stuff here. Um, this coffee probably is not going to be incredibly worthy. Uh, but you know what, we can just buy it, so why not do it? Right, and then we've got a lot of units and a lot of ransacking actions. So, I've been thinking a little bit in between episodes, and that is, um, I think this area down here, around Knossos, isn't actually looking too bad. So what we've got over here is we've got a lot of dye. You can see like eight sources of dye here. Now, dye does only give you about five industry per dye on each city. So, honestly, that's not as much. Like, five industry? Eh, who cares? You'd think, right? But eight dye? That's already 40 industry. That's already kind of significant. And then, soon enough, we will be able to build the luxury uh, districts. And with eight luxury districts, we can get another 40% boost and a crazy plus 80 stability. So I think it would be pretty good to get these dire resources. And I think that might actually be a little bit better than trying to get Sipar. So we might ultimately try to conquer Knossos and... To do that, I think we are going to keep some of these areas down here and shift our looting a little bit to the north, I think, and then maybe actually uh, onto Sipar as well. So, yeah, let's see what um, we can do in that regard. I'm going to come in between here because I do want to find out whether we can go up here, and indeed we can, and there's actually a unit up there too, uh, which we're going to send off packing. That's cool. You guys are just going to be here to heal up, so that's cool. And then we can try to fight another battle here. I don't think they should be able to withdraw, actually. So let's do... Uh, I think this is the first naval battle that we're going to have over here. So yeah, let's go ahead here. We actually have some cannons here. They're going to come in closer. They're going to apply the border status to us. Um, I suppose we could actually get in the cork too. So the cock is not a gun platform, but let's see. Okay, yeah, that, that was it. Easy, but still effective, I think. And there is a harbor down here, so that is something that we might want to grab. Also, this stuff here is now exploited, which does mean we can burn it down. So I would like to do that. All right, can we take it down here, please, in some fashion? It's going to take a while there. Right, and then you guys... How do we want to send you up there? So I think if we're going to attack Knossos itself, well, there's this annoying fortification there. Well, I suppose we can ride up a little bit towards them and check out what they've got. So let's keep everyone a little bit close together. Close-ish at least. Oh, look at that. Even more die. That's fantastic. If we could get all of that die, we'd be golden. And can you, in fact, burn something down? Like like that outpost there. Didn't know you could move up there. Oh, but there must be some road or something like that. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, we're going to burn it down then. Right, anything else? Uh, yeah, you guys. You can basically only explore here because we are expansionalist. But still, good to find some stuff. Ooh, speaking of finding stuff, there is some money. Not a lot, but it's actually less than one of our groups here. Four can handle all by its own. And you know, all the way over here. Fine. Let's uh, just fill in the gaps here. You are a Karag, right? So you are actually fit for the high seas. So yeah, we can send you up there into this unknown territory. That should be a okay. Right, you've burned that stuff down. Let's uh, send you up here so that you're supporting the other groups there. 
and you guys are actually why are you guys on in this terrain that I wonder it's a lot of units here lots of lots of Babylonian units right let's check on that more agrarian installs a new wonder can be claimed yeah I think we know that Rounds are successful. Lovely. Right, okay. And you're now a little bit lagging behind here. But that's going to be alright. So let's try to... I think we want to probably expand or at least check out what's going on in this direction here. That's unfortunate here. You guys have burned that down too. So yeah, let's do come over here. There we go. What have we got here? Don't think anything too important. Ooh. It's been, well, I was lying. Right, so you guys are doing fine there. This is this is all part of the area that we potentially would want to conquer. So I think we might actually start laying siege to this. We're gonna be building some battering rams over time. But we might want to grab it relatively quickly. Right, speaking of, you guys could actually be upgraded, and you know what, I think that is something that we're going to do. Chariots could, I think, get upgraded to knights, but you're not experienced or anything, so I think we're going to be alright. Uh, but what could be useful is, well, taking all of you, actually, and send them back towards this area, join the siege, and hopefully get some uh, actual, actual conquering of foreign lands, because... More industry, that's just incredibly useful. Right, you guys have come over here, that's okay. You know, you guys, you can potentially burn this down, can't you? It's going to take a long time to do that, but you will be able to do it. Another group up here, you're young, the Visigoth. That's interesting, we were playing as the Goths before, so I was kind of thinking that they would be counting as the Visigoth. Um, especially since we are now Spain, that uh, would make some sense at least. But alas, I don't think that's how the game treats this. Right, you are over here now. I would like to burn down this stuff here because it's probably likely linked to McKinney. Uh, right, and you guys have now some eyes on what they're doing up here. Can we attack them again? Ooh, this might not be the best idea. No, no, no. Heh. Heh heh. I did not expect there to be that many of you. No, no, I didn't want to hit retreat. Ooh, we're gonna lose an army here. Just because I hit the wrong button. Oh my god, that's gonna suck. Right, let's uh, pull these guys back a little bit to the rear there because we need them to smash into the enemy with a little bit of a run. Minus 96 there. I think we can try to kill them. Right, that's not a good space to be in. I think we can risk this. Yeah, just minus six. But they're going to shoot us up pretty badly. And that actually means they can feed on our carcasses, can't they? Effectively, that is what they're doing. Because I think they're going to get some food because they are counting as no nomads. And that does mean they're going to multiply by killing us. And that is one of the big, big downsides of fighting these guys. Too, too bad. There's just so many of them. Right, okay, let's pull you back to the rear there. And we're going to try to... Just finish you off here. You guys are going to stick in the rear there because you're going to give us some bonuses for adjacent units. And I think otherwise you'd just die. Okay, let's uh, try to deal with some of the other things here. Right, you guys are doing okay, but maybe it is time to come down there. Well, let's go there first, and then let's, let's actually check on these guys here because I think we can buy some of your stuff. There's the incense, which is giving us some money. That's not the big thing. Pearl, I think, is going to actually give us a lot more money. Ah, 14. But I still think it's worth it. It's around 20 turns. So 
finally burned down that silk. And then let's reopen this battle. Yeah, they've basically killed all of us. Oh my. So let's open this. They're gonna get 80 food. Which means they are gonna get a new entire unit, I think. That is, that is unfortunate, but you know what? At some point we were about to take some losses at any rate. Kermit, you're building the armory, that's cool. And then you're gonna build the tourney fields. That's lovely too. And then afterwards, I would very much like you to start building up conquistadors. Let's go for at least five of them. I'm thinking you could do it with a little bit more food, but you are already earning 200 and I don't think more than that is super useful. Could build some stuff over here, 18 plus 18 and 10. That's not terrible. But look at that, so that's so much better. Yeah, I don't think I don't think that's what we're gonna do. You know, let's go straight forward in building out these units. And you guys as well. Well, let's accelerate this a little bit because I think I would want you to be a little bit faster in doing this. Didn't we build, build, want to build a hamlet here? Twenty-five, twelve. It's not bad. Pretty much the only place where I think that does make some sense. Let's build it here. Then the high furnace is going to give us a bonus due to all of these maker quarters. It's going to take a while for you to really become effective. What are we researching at the moment? Alchemy. Well, well, well. Here we're going to maintain the siege. And the turn. You guys can join in on that. There's another ransack. Lovely. Good, good, good. There's also a battle somewhere. A merchant from afar. So we could consent to welcoming traders from afar. Chance of profit. This would move us towards world. I like to be moved towards homeland. So we're going to dismiss him. Gonna move everyone to move up. Uh, ask everyone to move up, that is. And then we've got some situation here. Yeah, you guys have been intercepted basically. By how many? That's around eight. And suddenly we're evenly matched. So. That's a get to a sensible allocation of forces here. But this is kind of okay that down there actually because it's it's wooded terrain and they would be needing to stand on the river tile. I'm afraid that they're going to come up here. So that is going to be that. Um, but I would like these guys to be there. Okay, you know what? That's fine. So they're going to attack now. I'm hoping that this guy is going to move away. So that we can smash into them with our heavy cab. Maybe I should have run away? I don't know. Certainly a lot of them. We're including these these uh, normal guys there. Big question is, is he going to move away? I would be standing on that tile if I was him. Yeah, okay. At least he's going to move away. That was so would have sucked a little bit. Yeah, and we're now counting as weaker. Not a big surprise. Okay, let's start by attacking here. You guys should probably switch places. But we need to deploy you. Let's run you here first. Attack these guys. There we go. We can only... Yeah, let's attack them because they are going to be rear uh, flanked from the rear. And um, apparently that didn't do any damage, or sometimes it just doesn't seem to update that properly. Okay, but that's basically it. We can't move anywhere else here with our troops. I 
That's really it, isn't it? Okay, then let's move you up there and then get another one. Just so that you guys are ready to move out when you can. Then what are we going to do here? Now, you guys are a little bit outmatched. So, let's bring you to the rear here. And then you guys be here. And we're going to end the turn here. And see what they're going to do. Probably attack us all around. I think these guys are going to be coming under heavy fire there. And they're pretty old units. Maybe except for the Swartzman. Yeah, even they. They are semi-old. That cavalry is not doing well. And yeah, we actually lost the... Lost a lot of units here already. Harsh. Harsh, really harsh. You're all gonna kind of move around. So I wanna get rid of these guys if I can. Then you're gonna come here, go into flank them from the rear. Nice. Try to get rid of you. Why does it always jump to this this stuff? It's really not what I wanted. But yeah, we did get rid of them though, so that's nice. And then... We could attack you. You are on that tile that's not really good for you. Let's attack them down there. That's okay there. Fine. But I would probably want you to be... Let's attack these guys. Yeah, we're going to take heavy losses here again. Because they did flank us. And we were really not able to bring most of our forces in. Which was really unfortunate, but... And at least we are fighting back. The Hunnics and the Mongols are so strong. The Hunnics, the Huns. Right, attack you here. Move you guys to the rear there. Come over here, attack you again. Nice. Finish them off, and then let's attack that guy. It's a defeat. It's a defeat, but that's fine. They've um, earned some, some food, which is pretty bad but at least we did not lose any of our horses here and I think we might be able to salvage that that much at least right let's set you up to be moved up next turn though that's then crucial you guys can move around here Ooh, interestingly enough they do have a ship here a pentaconta I think our cock is going to be superior to that but still interesting Okay, you guys have finally managed to come down here. Let's uh, send you back to the north then. And likewise, you guys are going to go into the big unknown. Great unknown. And then we got a scout. Are you on auto explore? I think you, you, you're kind of... I missed you completely. Well, that's fine though. Okay, so I think... It is time for you guys to start making your way down here. Because we will need some reinforcements down there. Irrespective of uh, being able to loot up there. Right, you guys... Uh, yeah, I think I wanted to burn this. Is that also a harbour? That's a trade port. Well, let's burn this stuff first. And up here you guys were doing fine. You know what? Let's let's burn the market quarter too. How is the siege going then? So we've got a single battering ram. Which is certainly not gonna be enough to bring down their actual pretty nice walls. So instead we might want to send you around here. I don't want you to be involved if we don't need you to be involved. You're fine over here. Let's uh, 
smash these places. You need to remember to zoom in sometimes because sometimes uh, you're not spotting the other things. Right, everyone move up. Including you there. Oh, where's that battle now? Up over here. Is it just five of them? It is just five of them. Still, I don't want to risk it. We're going to retreat and hopefully we're going to retreat in a correct direction. And we are doing the exact opposite as I see. Well, that's not good. Okay, let's try to get you... Oh god, this is going to be a mess. Well, at least you guys can reinforce them. Right, up over here we do have the battle. I don't think they're going to attack us right now. Ooh, there's some people moving in down here. That's interesting, not really critical, but still interesting to know. Ooh, and we've got another tenant here. That's great. We're going to pick Mediate often because two combat strength on every unit. Yeah, sure. We are going to choose that tenant. So our fighters are going to be slightly better off even. Ooh, um, you're going to attack us here. I don't actually thought that you would, honestly. What other battle do they have? Oh, they are attacking us now. Well, in that case, I would have loved you guys to be involved. But sure, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna take that fight. Um, and obviously, the way to do that is uh, at least pulling back a couple of our units. Well, let's put you guys in the front there. I don't think there's really much that we want to do or can do, but they're gonna attack us. We're gonna be standing on this river for for to a large extent. Are they sorting out? That's that's interesting that they can do that in this way. And interesting that these guys are standing up there. But these one, pretty much all of them entirely pointless. Right, let's right up here. Flank them. There we go. You guys, right down there. Attack them. Neat. I think you can smash them. Come up here. Attack these guys in the rear. Have you guys come up here. Attack them in the rear. Can't attack them any further. Can no, I can. Nice, let's do it. Right, you guys should be able to come over here. Oh no, there is. Why were we able to cross into there? I didn't I didn't expect that. They're guardian and they're defending. Hmm. That's honestly a little bit surprising that they managed to do that. And unfortunately, unfortunately, they do have spearmen. And oh my god, they are pikemen actually. Okay, they are pretty tough. We do really need our conquistadors, I think. Right, let's attack in the city here. Yeah, we're losing a little bit of our edge, I have to say. Yeah, these guys are standing on pretty good tiles, so I think we're going to lose one of our units here. Yeah? But one of them is not the worst. Two would be kind of iffy. You can walk around there. And you guys, you know what, let's move over there. We're going to at least find out a little bit more about this, this world. Um, and some of you are fine. Let's end the round. Let's see what they're going to do. I think they're going to attack them. Yeah, they are. Of course they would be. Some attacks here within the city. Understandable. Now here's the thing, we can't ride into that city, so we actually need to move out of here and into places where they would need to actually come out of the city to actually properly attack us. Otherwise, they're not gonna do that. Otherwise, they're gonna stand back. And that is just how good that city is, because if you're standing outside of its walls, if you're just keeping a little bit of distance, you're a little bit screwed. And the round. See, now they need to come out to actually properly attack us, which they are going to do there. Losing us another unit. Just like to see that, to be quite honest. Right, but I think what we can do is do a nice charge down the river here with some of our units in the rear. And that is pretty nifty. Right, let's pick another unit. 
And apparently I did move that in the wrong spot. Why can I not attack this round? Quite frankly, that seems to be silly to me. Right, so. Finish you off. Yeah, that managed to finish you off. How about an attack on these guys? Yeah, that works lovely. How about another attack on these guys? Fantastic. Can we please finally attack and kill them? Yeah, there we go. That should settle that victory, and that does actually mean we now control Knossos. Good thing about that is all of our units will heal over here now. So that is pretty fantastic. A lot of experience here too. I like it. That's lovely. That's really, really nice. Asua, you have finished a couple of things, uh, and we've just discovered something, right? So I think plus 10% signs, that's 40 signs. Yes, we are going to do it. Nice. And what else? Stability is fine, so we don't need to be concerned about these things. Industrial quarter, any of these things? No, no, no. I think you are fine as you are. So, other than that, we're going to continue our path on research quarters with you, I suppose. Could build a single thing there. It's going to be alright. Yeah, we do have 2,000 influence, so... I think we're going to do something similar down here, and that is... We're going to merge you guys in. And then... We are going to ransack that city. Because ransacks mechanics are really, really weird. Right, while we're here, you guys are going to try to land in around Peacock. You're going to burn that down and then we're going to attach it and, and rebuild it and attach it to us, sure. Uh, pff, you don't need to do anything. You're going to be gone next turn. Right, interesting stuff over there. But let's continue exploration here with the cog. And you guys can do come down here. You guys are going to clarify that. Correct here. Let's continue to keep an eye open for any anomalies. And we're going to end the turn. Nice. Mutinous and Gnosis. Yeah, that's... Uh, not going to last very long. But now you should we should see that the wall support here of them should be coming down each turn. Even though uh, they've won some nice uh, victories in the past couple of turns here. It's not an important fight. We actually were victorious here. But I suppose um, this is really a signal for us to go. So let's leave them. I think they're feeling a little bit suspicious about us. You have my ear. They're traitorous. They add grievances. I don't think they did. At least not recently. But yeah, uh, they don't definitely don't want us here, so yeah, let's not overstay our welcome. Speaking of, we've got another Hunnic Horde here. Let's try to smash in them. There we go. Come on. They're gonna run away, but I'm hoping that we can catch them if we do follow them up in this direction. Right, you guys, oh, we've got another fight over here, which is unfortunate. So they are somewhere over here. Can we catch you? I mean, potentially? Okay, now they cannot run away, and that's actually a fantastic thing for us, because we've got the heavy cavalry, we've got the first charge here. I like it. Nice, there we go, good strike. Two of them killed before they really couldn't get off any shots. Let's go. 
And they're gone. Yep, they are. Another error star unlocked. We're actually almost in the next error here already. Uh, we'll need to decide whether we actually want to pursue that path uh, or whether we want to actually delay that for a moment, which would be completely viable. Um, but we just need to decide there. Right, you guys are fine over here. Why is it actually only two of you still? Ah, we lost some, some of the lighter units because I didn't pay attention to who you were, right? Mm -hmm. That's okay. I think you are starting to lose your effectiveness soon as well. Oh, that's a very well-placed fortification there. These guys are not going to take that fight. Because they'd be foolish too. Uh, is that actually white space up here, or is that just temporary fog of war? No, no, I think there was something more serious. Okay, uh, let's try to get on this island here with you guys. Um, and likewise with you. Right, now we've got this fight up here. We'll need to take care of that. Anything else, though? Yeah, you guys have finished up here. Let's check what's down there. Not much. So we can go back to this island. This Karak? I almost didn't want to send it down there. But I think we have one that's more closer, right? Yeah, we do. Right, your job is going to be to come over here. And your job is going to be to come into this area there. Right, that does make some sense. Right, you have done what you need to do here. Let's re-establish the outpost and then immediately attach this outpost to the city. Should give us a lot of bonuses. Allocate people to science, to industry, and some of them to trading. That's cool. What have we got down here then? We've got a research quarter, a farmer's quarter, another farmer's quarter, maker's quarter, maker's quarter, commons quarter. Yeah, well, the commons quarter is always kind of weird. Could build another industrial quarter. 24, I mean, that's not terribly bad, is it? Oh, and we can build out the saltpeter right down there. We can also build another harbor and some other districts here. You know, I think we're going to build another industrial district, maker's quarter. That's cool. Okay, so what have we got here? We've got a single group of our heavy cab against a mixed group of theirs. So. I think it makes sense to do a manual battle. We are fully squeezed into that corner. They're going to win that fight immediately, aren't they? We're going to be completely hemmed in there. That is kind of terrible. Right, okay, so let's grab a reinforcement here. Unfortunately, we do not have that multi-move, so... You'll actually need to fight your way out of this. One by one, just one by one. We're gonna die and we're gonna try to get rid of them. That's gonna be annoying. We are losing terribly here. And we can't actually bring these people in. Well, what we can do though is get out of this field here. They've made a mistake here now. Nice. That at least was a good move. They've still got six units though. We only have three. Especially as they're standing on that tile over there. And they can fight us from the rear. Right, let's try to 
be a little bit on the safe side. So we're going to lose this battle and that's that's fine. But we still didn't lose too many units and I think they actually did not gain more than, than, than uh, we lost. So at least I would call that a draw. Right, you are pillaging there. We don't have anything else here to pillage, so I think we can start to move up a little bit. At least down down towards here. Let's go there. We're not too keen on fighting the Babylonians for now. But obviously at some point we will. Okay, I think we'll need to fight that battle up there. So let's bring some reinforcements closer to this to this group. But what we really do need is stronger reinforcements. Kerma, how are you doing? You are in fact building your first conquistador, so that is a good development. Um, some science boost would be lovely. Who's actually our best science city? Ashur followed by Hatusha. Hmm. Well, we did expect uh, Ashur, but I did not quite expect Hatusha. Got a lot of money. Can we buy out maybe the hamlet? We could, but it's terribly expensive. So that's going to be the main priority, I think. Napta. Are oh, you building that stupid obelisk? Yeah, that's been sitting in your in your cree there for a long while. I would actually like you to be a little bit more science focused. Yeah, 230, so this over here. Oh yeah, we can build more of that. You actually, you actually kept on food. Very few of our places are kept on food. You've got two harbors, that would be six food. We can also simply build this. Yeah, let's prioritize that. Not that it's, it's, it's weird that always that sort of place on our continent seems to be uh, having the having the harder time. Right, but I'm, I'm hopeful at least that we are going to make some progress there. And their war support should be dwindling, right? So that war support should be coming down. It's only a matter of time. Right, let's try to get you down here. Jesus, this is going to be difficult. They are immediate. No, they are attacking us here. Interesting. Um, here we can retreat. That's not a biggie. You guys, can I attack you? I have something here. I'm not really interested in this for the moment. There. Sorry. Can I get back to over here? And can we do the first attack? Are you running away there? And every time they are running, we are going to get some wall support. Nice. Okay, so that's at least something that we're doing over here. Can we burn this? Cannot be done by a retreating army. Interesting. Now their copper could be kind of useful for us to destroy. Hmm, you guys are kind of weak, but... How about we come down here? You guys should really start to heal up, because I think we are losing too many units. Yeah, they are they are running all of the time. Their, their wall support must be so, so low. Non-aggression pack? No, 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 we're not going to do that. And what are you guys doing? You're feeling hesitant. Well, I kind of got that, but let's see. Right, so Idolamis, yeah, you guys, um, do just heal up for a moment here, please. You guys are doing fine over here. Can we burn it down anything there? No, we can't. Well, we can check on this territory, and I think this is a high industry place for them, so that could enable them to build further units, so let's try to burn that down for the moment. Yeah, there's no luxury resource there, so we don't need that. Uh, we're going to refuse that. 
Oh. What's going on? There is a lot of islands there. How about the Ghanaians and the... And the Mayans? Interesting. We're going to allow you to trade and... I don't actually mind supporting you a little bit. So if you can get anything useful out of that trade, please do feel free to just take it. Right, you guys are gonna move back towards Peacock and then you can heal up a little bit. I think that's gonna be the plan for all of you guys up there. Right. Sitting around a little bit here. More strategic resources. They often seem to be in these uh, kind of desolate places. Oh, you are cock, right? Yeah, I should not have placed you on the on that tile there. Right, you guys can go to the new world, I suppose. Yeah, it's a good it's a good terrain here, though. I think this could also be a good science quarter, shouldn't it? Fourteen. Yeah, well, there are some bonuses, but the adjacency bonuses up here do supersede that, so I think that's gonna be alright. Good, I like it. And here is our first Conquistador. He only have one experience? Oh, I really would have hoped that you would have a little bit more than that at this point. We did build the armory here, right, in Kerma? What's it called? The... Yeah, the armory. We should be getting 75... stuff there. Hi, can we buy stuff? No. You guys are all pretty much useless. Any other place? No. Well, too bad. I would have hoped that we could buy a little bit more stuff there. Okay, but you guys... I think I don't want to keep you alone, so let's wait until a couple of more guys here have joined up. Um, and honestly... Can just buy at least one more. Buy two more. Then I think we have a good basis here to send you out and send you guys out next turn. Yeah, you're gonna be a strong force. Then you guys can continue to pretty much build that. You're gonna earn the food here to replenish a couple of these guys. Probably not quite enough, right? So maybe I'm thinking. You know what, you guys do turn over towards Kerma to be turned into better stuff in the future. Good. I like it. Christians, can we maybe get some of you to join us? No, potentially not. But yeah, I think their war support must be coming down. I think in just 15 turns or so, you can probably, we can probably take Gnosis from them. These guys, I cannot buy you, can I? You'd be pretty good, especially against all of their cavalry. But I don't think we can. And that being said, I think now is a good place to put in a cut. So thank you very much for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed. Do leave a like and let me know what you thought of all of these lost battles. Uh, until next time, bye-bye then.